Welcome to North Vernon, Indiana, home of the Hylex Poly Recycling Plant. This is the world's largest plastic film recycling plant. We will recycle up to 10 million pounds of stretch wrap this year and another 12 to 15 million pounds of t-shirt bags. Well, actually it starts back in the house. It starts when, when you take your groceries home and you don't put that plastic bag in the trash. You either reuse it or recycle it. Consumers want to do what's right. They want it to be convenient though too, and that's why the bag to bag program is so unique. Hylex Poly has developed 30,000 recycling points throughout the country. Take it back to the retailer, drop it off in the drum, and the program does the rest. Plastic recycling is much more efficient than paper recycling. Well, we put this plastic recycling line into service in January of 2010. We doubled our recycling capacity. In the United States, 854 million pounds of plastic and film has been recycled since 2009. That's 27 pounds per second. Consumers are being educated. They're starting to sort out their PET bottles. They're starting to sort out aluminum cans, taking their receipts out of the bags, but we still have a little bit to go. This is an emerging industry. Even though we're recycling 25 million pounds per year, we're not stopping there. We're continually working on new batches, new ways to improve our recycling process. In this lab, we're trialing new materials two, three, four times a week. After the plastic has been sorted, it begins the melting process. It goes through a series of filters, and then it's pelletized. In 2008, Hylex Poly recycled 400 million bags. That's the equivalent of eight million pounds of virgin resin. And this is how we did it. And it's ready to continue its journey into a new bag. I'm very proud of this product because with this material here, we have post-consumer coming back from bag to bag all over the United States. It's taken pellets into a molten plastic up into the point to where it forms the bubble. And this is what we call our cooling time, which allows the film to actually wind up on the core here. With this process of applying the ink, we also have the ability that we can reprocess over and over and over again due to the fact that we use reprocessed materials in our film and then reprocess the ink that is water-based, environmentally friendly. Our goal by the year 2015 is that we will have 25% post-consumer in our bags, 40% total recycled. That is something that in my lifetime, in my career, you know, I didn't think was possible, but yet it is possible. It's the most exciting thing in our business right now, in my opinion, that we're able to produce something like this.